Tiger Woods' return to the spotlight might be a short one. According to a letter from PGA Tour Commissioner Tim Fincham, Woods will return to therapy after he speaks publicly Friday. The letter was obtained by the Associated Press. Woods' statement will be the first time he speaks about his infidelity, which became known after he was involved in a November car crash in his neighborhood in Orlando. The world's number one golfer will speak at 11 a.m. from the clubhouse at TPC Sawgrass, the home of the PGA Tour. He will only release his statement and not answer questions. Big mistake by not taking questions. Tiger Woods right now has to let everybody in. He's locked us out. He needs to answer the questions. At some point he'll get these questions from somebody, but he needs to answer them now. Woods will make a statement with colleagues, friends, and family in attendance. Only three reporters from the AP, Reuters, and Bloomberg will be there. The Golf Writers Association of America was offered three reporter spots, but it's boycotting the event since reporters will not be allowed to question Woods. The best case scenario is that Tiger Woods goes out there, he gives a real heartfelt apology, that's what the media wants, that's what the public wants, it's what he needs, and that he actually lays some groundwork to making it up to his fans, the public, and certainly his family. The scene outside TPC Sawgrass is being described as a media circus. Seven satellite trucks are now camped out on the club's entrance, and all three major networks will air Wood's statement live. Even the gambling world is getting involved. A British bookmaker has set odds at 4-7 to seven that Woods' wife Ellen will be with him. 8-1 to one that Woods will announce he's getting a divorce and 100-1 to one odds that he's retiring. Brian Thomas, The Associated Press.